early on in my life, I became very aware of the power of words and the ability of a teacher to make a difference in a life. I think one of the first times it really woke in me was when my own mother in Children's Church in Memphis, Tennessee, she taught. I had never really heard her before, and it was the way she delivered and even the way she prayed left an impact on me because it was different than something I'd ever heard before. As I went on in my life, there were other men and women who would show up, some on radio, some in person. There were some teachers who the way they shared just spoke to me in a way that, that made an impact on me and it helped me understand more clearly what they were trying to communicate. And I remember growing up thinking that's something I wanted to do. That's something that I wanted to be able to speak into other lives. But from the very beginning, I wasn't enough. I remember in the beginning, it was because I was too young. And then I began to think, well, I'm, I'm not experienced enough. Well, then I, I didn't have the education. I wasn't smart enough. Uh, I wasn't in the right place enough. There is a, every time there seemed to be uh, something welling up in me to do something, to, to be a part of something, I always held back because of that not enough. I wonder sometimes about us. I wonder of even about you. Maybe you can relate to what I'm talking about here. That in your heart for a long time, there's been something that you have had a desire to do. Something that you've desired to go see or be a part of or, or dream or grow or plan or paint. But for some reason, you were held back because you weren't enough. I think that's the joke of life. Because... What if you really are enough? What does enough look like anyway? And what if right now for such a time as this you were born and that gift is uniquely yours, that voice, that painting, that whatever is uniquely yours and it doesn't get done unless you do it? What if the whole thing is a ploy to hold you back, to keep you from ever really knowing your full potential and to ever really accomplish what you were designed to accomplish? And the truth is, what if we're not enough? What does it really matter? Today, what if you are enough? How would you act differently?